Today's episode has been brought to you by Raycon Earbuds at buyraycon.com. Hey man, did you hire a band to play at my house? Aren't they great? They're called the Renegade Grass Cutters. What'd you think? I told them to leave. Whoa, what? You said you love to listen to music. I love listening to music on my everyday earbuds by Raycon. Not on my front porch while I'm trying to work. Oh yeah, Raycons. I just got my new pair in the mail. Yeah, it's great paying half the price of other premium audio brands for the same, if not better, earbuds. Heck yeah. I've been using the noise isolation feature to ignore Fendel. I can ignore him for up to eight hours on account of the battery life. I like the custom gel tips. You can find the perfect size for a comfortable fit. There's a reason they have over 50,000 five-star reviews. Hey, so do you just want me to cancel this Bob Denver polka cover band, The Polka Dots? What do you think? No. Block out the noise with Raycon. Click the link in the description or go to buyraycon.com slash manshorts to get 15% off your Raycon order today. Plus, free domestic or flat fee international shipping. Man Shorts. This is going to get confusing almost immediately, so let's just dive right in. This week, your character sheets are based on each other. Lance, you'll be playing as Sarah. Sarah, you'll be playing as Waylon. And Waylon, you'll be playing as Lance. I've had nightmares better than this. Your story begins at a friendly local gaming store. Looks like there are several groups starting to set up. What would you like to do? Okay, guys, this is going to get really meta really fast, so maybe we should wear some name tags or something. Yeah, but which names would we put on the name tags? That was the fastest bad idea I've ever seen. Speaking of bad ideas, a store employee approaches and asks if the three of you will be playing as individuals or in a group. I don't individuals. know. Yikes. Well, single players are a lot easier to match up, and I already know of a group that had a no-show, so let's see if we can get the rest of you grouped up. The employee waves for you to follow. Aw, oh, man. I was really hoping we'd get to play together. Well, I'll miss you guys. Ew. We're not going to be gone that long. I bet you're happy. Good luck, losers. All right, everyone roll initiative to see which groups you get. 11. 21. 16. Okay, L Lance, you're at Fred's table. He's a first-time DM, and it actually looks like there's a couple of first-time PCs at the table as well. Oh, it figures I'd get stuck in a party full of noobs. Let me guess, we're playing Curse of Strahd? It's a one-shot to try out new playtest material. Anyone want to trade? No trading. Sarah, you'll be joining the Axis of Axes, a 3-5 group of men-maxing murder hobos. They're in need of someone with a hunger for danger and a killer instinct. <clears throat> cool. Waylon, you'll be in a D20 future campaign, and you're in luck. There's one space left on the ship. Well, count me in, Captain. Cadet Meltzer reporting for duty. This is getting weird. Getting? Waylon, your DM Jamie introduces herself. Well, hello, Cadet. It's good to have you on board. It's great to see somebody that takes role-playing so seriously. Maybe you can bring it out of the others. Rad. Give me a charisma check. 23. The table thinks you're really cool. One of the players says, I like your glasses. No way. What do you mean, no way? And the meta begins. What's, uh... Lance's charisma score. Yeah, it's a 19, but I have an ability that gives me a plus two if I make a check with a positive attitude. Well, that's stupid. I want bonuses. You're Sarah. You're just mad because you don't know how to use my high wisdom score. Yeah, well, have fun being a space cheerleader. <sighs> now we need to go over your other characters. Lance, Sarah will be playing as a wizard, and since you'll be using new playtest rules, you'll need to pay close attention to how the spells work. Why would I ever do that? You wouldn't. Sarah, Waylon will be a paladin. 3.5 paladins have to be lawful good. They sure do. Waylon, Lance will be a space monkey. You've also been asked to be the captain of the ship. This is going to be bad, you guys. Lance, as the game starts, give me a knowledge mechanics check. 12. You think you understand how the new spell slots work, but you can't be sure. And honestly, you don't care. Hold on. How is it even possible for me to roll this low? Doesn't seem likely. I'm actually surprised you rolled that high considering her score. What's that supposed to mean? Let me see that. Is this meta? I don't even know anymore. The sheet is completely wrong. To be clear, these meta PCs are approximations of your in-game selves. They're not necessarily exact representations of who you are as people. Very diplomatic response. A very legal response. Fine, but I'll remember this. Sarah, your party has started a barroom brawl. What would you like to do? 
Can I do an insight check on myself? What? I'm Waylon. So if I do an insight check on myself, couldn't I determine what he would do? That's what I would do. She's been me for five minutes, and she's already OP. Fine, I'll allow it, but you'll have to roll against your own charisma. That's, uh, 22 to insight. Against a 16 charisma. It works. You suddenly know exactly what to do, and you manage to stop the fight before there's any more bloodshed. Yahoo. She can't even roll under a 15 when she wants to. That was out of character. Which one? Waylon, Jamie has invited you to start things off by introducing yourself to your crew. My name is Zebob Alonzo III, and I'm a swindler. I'm trying to raise my wealth score, and maybe raise a little hell in the process. Give me a performance check with advantage. 9 and 19. Your strong intro inspires the rest of the party to put a little more effort into their own. Your DM is impressed. Guys, this is going way better than I thought it would. Yeah? For some of us. I'm just happy I didn't have to be you. This was such a bad idea. Y you can't use modify spell to modify the spell, modify spell. Why not? I don't see anything that says that. Modify spell is a ritual, which allows you to modify arcane spells. Fine. I'll change the concentration on wall of force to unbreakable, and then I'll just cast that. I just realized you're as bad as she is. Thanks. I'm not that bad, am I? Are you saying that as you or as me? Well, we're done here. This was way worse than I thought it could be. I had a great time. Yeah, well, if I got to be me, I'd be pretty happy too. Maybe we rein it in with something less complicated next week. Definitely. But what? Could we have written this more confusing? <laughs> this show's already meta, because it's people playing characters playing characters, but this time, it's people playing characters playing characters who are playing characters. Yeah. Playing other people's fun. To like remember all their mannerisms. Justin's teaching me how to be his fiance. <laughs> this is weird. You have to do it with more is my next line. I'm I'm really glad he it's just labeled as Waylon. Put Lance but in blue or something. <laughs> this could have been way more <laughs> fucked up. This is actually more acting than I thought it was going to be initially when you said I was going to have to play Sarah when I found out I was playing Sarah. Speaking of bad ideas, a store employee impro <laughs> Are you saying that to uh, as If it doesn't say as Lance, am I just me? Yeah. Yeah. Am I myself? Who am I? <laughs> she does do that sometimes, yeah. so I will remember to do that at least once or twice. <laughs> I don't know. That's the line. <laughs> I'm the star now. <laughs> it's gotten to his head. You get one episode, and now all of a sudden, he's got a rider and stuff. Like, <laughs> just need to use my hands a lot more. Yeah. It's very wrestling. He does sort of just play like a wrestling character. Yeah. I mean, Rigsby will fit in my shirt, so I could just... When's he filming? Tomorrow. Tomorrow? Tomorrow yeah. Let's see if we can get you grouped up. The employee waves for you to flop. All those words, <laughs> and then I can't say follow. <laughs> all of that, and then it's like, flalo. Follow me, and everything is all right. It's just Zebob Alonzo the third is just taking up all the room in my brain. Wait, no, she's Waylon. No, she's yeah, Waylon's me. That'd be a pretty good washing machine, I think. Yeah. That would be a great job, I think. Just hold the barrel and move around. Yeah, do the agitation cycle. For some reason, that was just a wailing line when I looked at it, so I was like, well, I'm done. Those are the worst moments where it's like, I'm not getting it, and so then I take a moment to get it, and then I still don't get it. <laughs> Back to Lance. Straight here, <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> I'll take my Oscar later. 
true, <laughs> I would have not been able to do Lance. Yeah. Or maybe I would. I don't know if I would have. <laughs> <Wish pal! laughs> Gosh, dude. Can we make a horror movie with her in it, please? <laughs> <laughs> we'll call it Flalo. <laughs> it Flalos. <laughs> it's just her, like. What did you say? Howdy do, I'm Lance. <laughs> Mostly, I'm fortunate that I've been able to ignore the coordinates. I got a history of being insubordinate, but what if he was gonna be when the fortune hits? Like, dang, he said he would do it, and he really did it. He really committed. The kid wasn't kidding. We should have listened instead of calling him a degenerate. Been independent. I'm into administering a percentage of them in a dome. I'm winning attention again and again, and I got him grinning when I enter the room, bringing the boom. One of a kind. I'm not here to change your mind. I'm here to remind you that finding the fire inside you is what's gonna keep you alive. Baby, like yo, ain't you like 35 years old? How you been living with the flow so cold? Tell him that I keep warm with my alchemist fire I stay warm with my alchemist fire Baby like yo, ain't you like 35 years old? How you been living with the flow so cold? I tell him that I keep warm with my alchemist fire I stay warm with my alchemist fire